Welcome, in front of me is a Honor X6A and today I will show you how we can record screen on this phone. So to get started you want to pull down your notifications by swiping down from the top of your screen. Now here you'll find a bunch of toggles and one of those should be screen recording toggle. As you can see for me is visible right over here. Now if you don't see it, um, well right out the front, you could extend the list by swiping down and then you have a little bit more room to scroll down on. And additionally you could also tap right here this box and this will show you toggles that would be turned off which you would then be able to grab, drag it over the top, come on, drop unless you need to remove one. Yep, it looks like we need to remove one. And from there you have access to additional or different toggles. In any case, once you see it, you can simply tap on it. So I'm going to mute the microphone, or I did make sure that it's muted, and it's going to record your screen right away. Now you can open up different applications, uh, which the screen recorder will attempt to record, unless you open up some scammy ones like Netflix, uh, that basically shows you a middle finger and tells you, no, you're not going to be recording that, and it does so by just allowing you to record fully black screen. Now you can see we can see content on here right now and keep in mind me swiping through pages leaves this kind of dot behind my finger that will just show later on on the recording where my finger was pressing the display and what I was doing which obviously will indicate that I was flipping through these pages that you just seen. Anyway once we're done we can click right here to stop the recording and it will automatically get saved to the gallery application or photos whatever we have right here. I have gallery. So let's open it up and it looks like it's going to be visible right and under the photos tab but we should also have it under albums and you can see there is the videos so you can find it under videos as well so here is the screen recording So let me, while this is playing back, uh, let me explain the Netflix kind of uh, debacle right here. So what happens is Netflix can block screen recorders and they're doing this for absolutely scammy reasons uh, by invading uh, your own privacy because they need to know what you're doing, meaning for instance, AKA recording your screen for you to be, for them to be able to block it, right? Which I would kind of consider to be a little bit intrusive. Uh, and you can see there's the black screen. It's fully blocked. That's what you're going to get on the recording. And this feature, as in blocking the screen recorders, is done for security reasons. And in applications like bank applications, that would make sense. When you need to put in your PIN, you wouldn't want some spyware to basically be able to see what kind of PIN you're using for your application and all the other uh, sensitive information, like, for instance, your card, in, uh, card number and all the uh, info behind it as well. So in that aspect, this is a good feature uh, where it's kind of shit was when applications like Netflix, which have basically zero reason to utilize this uh, apart from their own corporate greed. Uh, that's where I have a problem with it. And we as users of Android don't have any kind of control over this. So uh, basically what we need to do is just suck it up. Uh, there are some ways around it for certain brands uh, that allow you to kind of get around it. Uh, but for 90% of the devices, and this is not possible, or as far as I know, it's not possible. And uh, yeah, we just kind of have to deal with this. So if you ever encounter your screen recording has just fully black screen, just know that whatever you are trying to record uh, didn't really like that and prevented you from doing so. So anyway, with that being said, hopefully you found this video helpful. And if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.